Hi folks, I'm Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness. On May 19, 2013, I was illegally stopped by Malheur County Sheriff's deputies in Oregon. We've already posted a video I shot of that stop and it's sufficient to expose that the Malheur County Sheriff's Department has some bad cops. Now, however, using Oregon's public disclosure laws, we have obtained the police videos of the stop. It turns out the officers recorded far more than they intended. I didn't want to stop them. I'm For years, Shark has exposed the corruption of police departments like the Malheur County Sheriff's Department, those who partner with the rodeo mafia. I was stopped on May 19 so that the deputies could illegally force me to identify myself. Although I was in a rented car, Officer Brian Belknap takes down the VIN number of my personal vehicle. The illegal stop was to protect the cruel Jordan Valley Big Loop Rodeo and its committee, which includes other Malheur County Sheriff's deputies. The deputies conducting the stop speak openly among themselves about why they are committing misconduct and illegal acts, because at some point they forgot they were recording. Hmm, that's right, that VIN number down, that's a personal car, I'm guessing. Yeah, he's already got lawyers. Mm-hmm. We got to He said he is. This, this guy's the real deal. Harry Charles Ford. This guy is the one that posted everything last year on all the... Sure, sure. That's fine. Uh, we didn't here's do, the problem. We didn't do anything wrong. They didn't trust us when we were there. They asked me. Like Charles Warner on his cell phone as soon as he gets in the service. Well, even so, we're going off what we were told. I wasn't there. 14. So. Didn't. I didn't want to stop him there. The Malheur County Sheriff's deputy has a sweetheart deal with the Jordan Valley Big Loop Rodeo. The Sheriff's Department raises money at the rodeo. Sheriff's Department personnel are on the rodeo board. A bully named Bob Roten is one of those deputies. Malheur County Sheriff Brian Wolf loves the cruel Jordan Valley Rodeo so much, he put a rodeo flyer on the door of the Sheriff's Department headquarters, even though those headquarters are almost two hours drive away from the rodeo. Rodeo isn't the only activity in which Malheur County Sheriff's deputies have acted inappropriately. Officer Belknap, Lieutenant Hunsaker and Sergeant Williams, who were all part of this illegal stop, were among the Malheur County Sheriff's personnel who were successfully sued in federal court just a few years ago. The officers committed a warrantless entry without exigent circumstances and without probable cause. The disturbing details of the case included false police reports, damage to premises, and reckless and conscious, deliberate disregard for a plaintiff's civil rights and liberty. You can read the details of the case by clicking here. With that kind of conduct and that kind of officers in the ranks, the Malheur County Sheriff's Department is heaven sent for the rodeo mafia. Rodeos partner with corrupt police whenever possible, and the police then protect and enable rodeo animal abuse. Caring people worldwide look at the abuse of the Jordan Valley Big Loop Rodeo and are sickened and appalled. Sheriff Brian Wolf, however, wrote a letter to Oregon legislators urging them not to ban Jordan Valley's horse tripping in spite of the rodeo's indisputable and indefensible cruelty. Cruelty, arrogance, guns, and corruption. Are we talking about a police department or a criminal organization? If you're going through Oregon, you might want to do whatever it takes to avoid Malheur County because that sheriff's department may constitute a bigger threat to you and your family than any street gang. 
This is Steve Hindy for Showing Animals Respect and Kindness.